Well, punting and kicking the CFL is somewhat unique because, especially for American free agents, it's traditionally a Canadian position. So what they're requiring of the American free agents is to be able to do all three. You've got to be able to place kick accurately and deep, you have to be able to punt, and you have to be able to kick off. Um, there are a couple single specialists in the CFL who are Americans, but really, in a free agent camp, they're going to be looking at that guy that could do all three. The other thing with that is because of the different rule set, there's no fair catches in the CFL. The ball is always live. You have to give five yards on your coverage there when you cover down on the, the receiver. And the differences in the stadiums, the stadiums are more bowl-like, okay, because of the wider field. So there's a little bit more wind coming over top. So the idea of constantly getting kicks with hang time is a little bit less in the CFL. They expect their punters to be able to drive the ball. Hang time is important, but you have to still drive for directionality and length in the CFL. But if you're a one-trick pony, if you're a one-trick kicker, you're going to have a tough time making the CFL. You've got to work on all three kicks.